Hey everybody, it is Kathleen and welcome back to my channel. Hope you're having a wonderful magical day. Welcome to my channel if you're new. Welcome back if you're not. So today's video I'm very excited about. I meant to film it last week around the same time I was doing the pumpkin juice video but just didn't get around to it. But I'm excited because I finally decided to treat myself and get the Night Bus Harry Potter Lego set. I've been wanting this for so long and I finally decided, you know what? It's 2020. The world is crumbling. Uh, didn't want to make this a depressing video, but so, you know what? Life is short. Get Treat yourself to something you like and that's what I did. So, if you want to see me build this, that's what I'm going to do in this video. It's going to be a great time, so stick through to the end of the video and yeah, but before we get but before we get into that, if you haven't already, click that subscribe button down below and add a little more Lumos to your day. And give this video a big thumbs up if you'd like to see me do more Lego builds. Can't do one of the big giant sets because I don't have anywhere to put it, but like the small ones like this that could go on a, any of my bookshelves or, you know, or somewhere else, that'd be cool. So yeah, just um, give me a big thumbs up and let me know if you'd like to see me do that. Alright, so I am going to stop talking and let's get straight into the video. So this is going to be a bit of an odd angle for this video because I don't, I don't really have that fancy of a camera set up, it's literally just my phone. Maybe one day I will have enough money saved up to uh, get a nice camera to where I can do like, you know, cool um, shots and everything, but for now. We're just gonna do this. I have a card table, because again, we're not fancy here on Living Lumos. And yeah, let us get started. This is a 403 piece Lego build um, for ages eight and up. So thankfully I am within that age range. And if you can see from the back, it has some moving parts, like you can open it and it comes with Harry, um, Ernie, Stan Shunpike and the, the little uh, um, talking head, um, I think his name is Ed, right? Correct me if I'm wrong. So yeah, it comes with a bunch of cool stuff and I am excited to get it, um, get, it out of, get it out of this box and put it all together. So I'm going to go get ahead and get all the bags out, but in the magic of editing, it'll be now. Alright, so we have all of the contents of the box right here so if you've never done a Lego build before and it's been honestly a hot minute since I've done a Lego build if I remember one of the last Lego builds I did I'm pretty sure I was 12 or 13 and it was the crap crap well it was the Krusty Krab from Spongebob build so it's been quite a while so if you've never done one of these you have numbered bags so this is like going in steps which is really helpful if um, you uh, are very disorganized like I am and thought. And you also get some stickers which go on the build and you get your instructions. So let's get started. Well, we've already gotten started. I think I've said that a hundred times, but let's truly get started now. All right, so I have bag one here and I already decided to put together the some of the smaller pieces so we have Harry Potter if it'll focus on me and on him and not me and we have Stan Shunpike which I'll get close-ups of these later and ooh, you're not gonna be able to see this one but we have uh, a teeny tiny little shrunken head and I also went ahead and built this little trunk it has this little trunk there's a little tiny little things inside which I'm not going to be able to get the detail right now but there's a little chocolate bar, a Hogwarts letter or what's supposed to be a Hogwarts letter and this little bottle thing. I'm not sure what it's supposed to be. Maybe like a lamp or a lantern. I'm not sure. So now that we've gotten these tiny things done, I'm going to go ahead and start putting together uh, what I can. So basically you're built, we're building kind of the more interior parts it looks like of or the, I don't know, of the, of the bus. So. 
All right, so this is where we are so far. I just had to cut out because there's so many tiny pieces that um, it was gonna take forever. It's gonna be boring, but this is what I have so far. Um, I love that this little seat moves and there's the little um, stick shift thing uh, moves. My friend is a bus driver and if he watches this video, he's gonna roast me for not knowing what this is. <laughs> But yeah, and you got the steering wheel and it moves, so it's really cool. I'm gonna show more details too. Also, side note, I am not very talented at placing stickers, so if they're crooked, please don't roast me. All right, so I figured I was gonna film this part because it gets pretty exciting because we get to do all of the windows. Well, almost all of them. So, excuse me while I uh, put all the windows in these little uh, boxes. So I'm about to finish bag one item. All I gotta do is attach this other side. Uh, I'll do that. So this way. So, um, oh, I see. Okay, so basically this side. This side oh, oh, that's cool. All right. So, oh, that's so that's how that opens. So here we have the. This is all of the pieces in bag one. I obviously have these extra right here, but in every Lego set, you always have extras in case they effed up or you lose one, a couple of them. So, yeah. So, this is really cool. So, I have the swinging part, the moving parts, and Ernie kind of swings there. Or not Ernie, the uh, shrunken head swings in there, which I'll show that when I do a detailed view when I'm done. And I got my two of three um, characters that come in here and the trunk. So that is bag one all complete. All right, bag number two. Huh. Let's do this. All right, just checking in. Uh, we are definitely not even halfway through bag two, but it is looking really cool. I add this little seat on top and we're building up the top of it. And look, I even put the, I don't even think it's gonna focus on that. <laughs> oh man, hang on. Anyway, you can't really see it, thanks. But you'll see it in detail, but I put the night bus thing. So it's really starting to come together and take shape.
So this is what it looks like when bag two is all put on. This is so neat looking already. So you see we have, it's, it says the, oh come on, can you focus? Nope, you can't focus. It says night bus here and it says all destinations, nothing underwater here and here. Oh, it looks so cool already. And then obviously when you open it, you have the swinging chandelier that we just added. I'm going to need to polish these windows because I'm getting my fingerprints all over them. But it looks really awesome so far. I'm excited to see it all completed. So let's do it. That was a dumb transition. <laughs> All right, bag number three, the last one. Let's do this home stretch. Lego night bus all complete. I'm pretty sure you saw in the speed build section that I put this top part on backwards. I just now realized it, but I fixed it. It definitely looks a lot less awkward. I was like, why does it look so weird? And I was like, I didn't put it on the right way. So that is it. I will end this video with some fun uh, shots of this, maybe on my bookshelf, just looking all magical. So yeah, that is all for this video. Thank you so much for sticking around till the end. And I just want to let you know to be, to get excited for uh, what's going to come this month. As it is October and Halloween is coming up, I have some fun videos planned. Some fun projects. Maybe a couple of Halloween Harry Potter costume videos, maybe? Alright, that might be a little bit too much, a little too specific of a teaser. But yeah, that is all for this video. I'm going to end it here. Um, well, obviously, I won't be done once I'm done talking because I'm going to have some fun shots 
you know, you get the gist. But thank you so much for always hanging out with me and bringing Lumos to my life. And let's continue to live Lumos every day. Bye.